Like recording then. Let's do our split. Near Earth. Oh yeah, and it's red. It sucks. Okay, the following names. New Correct Century. That's the one th that we're from. Yeah. And there's the Lost Decade, yeah. Like, that's the one we're from. And then the AD Dimension. It has a blue ocean. And that's the Nadesco, the Jovian Lizard War, um, Seed, the Coordinators, and all that jazz. And the Universal Century, which is... Okay, so Laplace. Invaders came. The One Year War, 15 years ago. At the end of the war, the Get Array Escape Incident and the Second Impact both occur at nearly the same time, dealing a devastating blow to the Earth Federation. Yeah, I'll say the Second Impact de devastating blow. Jesus Christ, what a year! <laughs> so, the One Year War and then Get Arrays and Second Impact occur. Jesus fucking Christ. And then the Titans happened. And then Haman's Neo Zeon. And then Char did his thing. And now no one knows where he is. And Dr. Hell's invasion begins. Oh, that's. <laughs> NCC ADUC. And that test is going to tell us all about it. The invaders. The invaders. Bacterial life forms are just weird. Mm. They were compressed at a high density in the ghetto core and evolved into three apparent invaders. Sure, whatever you say. Yeah, the Super Robot Army. Yeah, he was imprisoned for the murder of Dr. Saratome. Of course he says he's innocent. You've met him? <laughs> Ryoma got arrested and then the one year war happened. I mean that's one way of letting the one year war happen because otherwise if Ryoma's out and about fighting like it doesn't like it's just over. Like he just goes over and blasts Skirin with a getter right and it's done. He doesn't give a shit. Yeah, didn't you say he'd killed that man? It's like, yeah, it turned out that actually he wasn't dead, and uh, Ryoma was innocent, and actually he was an invader. Just turned him into a weird dude full of griblies, it was awful. Just 
left it up. So it's like the Federation was worn out. So Roma was like, all right, let's go. However, no, Roma's not infected. The invaders had been exterminated. Yep, they shot a big missile at Dr. Satome's lab. And oh my the one year war and then Oh Jesus, the one year war happens and then Second Impact and the Deuteron missile. And everything got fucked up. Second Impact didn't have anything to do with either. I don't think you can say that. Like, the Second Impact probably happened how it did in Evangelion. But it's all incredibly secret bullshit, so she doesn't know why it happened. Like, as the missile hit, the second impact happened, and second impact happened at the North Pole? Yeah, so, all the Geta Rays went everywhere, and everything sucked. Second impact happened, and it sucked. That happened, and then, Rio Malagre became a ghost. I'm pretty sure the records say that he died, rather than... It is ghost now. Yeah, because the Gamillans, when they showed up, they like, we've been here three full days, and like, we've been in the other world for two weeks. So, dimensional quakes cause time problems also. But what exactly are ghetto rays? Eastern Evolution. Your exposure to them is wholly destructive. Ecological evolution. Yeah, you can evolve too much. You turn into too many eyes. Man, being haunted by Roma's ghost would be awful. Like, he'd karate chop you every day. Did that end the war? No, because... What I forget... Like, Zeon are even worse now, right? Like, they were already the worst, and now it's like, yeah, the world's completely fucked, and they're still causing shit. And 13 years after the war... The Titans showed up, and they were the Gestapo. Yeah, and the Grips conflict is um, Zeta Gundam, and it's the AUG versus the Titans, and then Haman Khan did Neo Zeon, was the first Neo Zeon war. And then she was bopped, so Shah then started the second Neo Zeon war, and kept dropping rocks on the Earth. <laughs> You know what? I don't think that's a thing that Akita would say. I don't think Akita would say, but some of it is pretty freaking different. I don't think that that's a line that... I don't think he would say the word freaking. Then, yeah, then there was the big rock, and they got him. And that was when Armour got pushed into the other dimension by the big rock. And so, the sleeves are happening currently. Yeah. Oh, <gasps> the second coming of Shah.
No, this is UC World. The NCC World it ain't so bad. Yeah. So okay, so there is ambiguity as to whether Shar is dead or not. Some questions we have about our own. He was a shithead. He was a shithead and he wanted to touch Amro's Pringler. Yeah. Like, in the NCC world, the Yamato world, they're just like, there's just a 10 year gap where we don't know anything that happened. I think I think Shah's gonna be gone and it's full frontal. He's gonna be the thing. Nah, I think Like we like you the end of Unicorn stuff would have to happen like Real soon, because I'm pretty sure we're going to jump before then, because that sounds like some endgame stuff. Oh yeah, okay, and now they're not going to mention the Mufti incident, which is Hathaway, Noah, yeah, he murdered corrupt officials and everyone was terrorists, but everybody liked it because everybody hated the government because the Federation of Jerks. And then, uh, he was executed by the government, uh, but his, fa they, his father signed the order and it crushed him. I don't know if it, yeah, I don't know if it can really be called war. Like the Federation is fucked. Well, he was terrorist man in Yamato world. This one, maybe he will avoid that fate. Yeah, it sounds like I think we're going to get Unicorn Bright. I know Sumeragi. You sort of did fight to lose. Well, they might make Banana good, because they don't have to play Unicorn straight. Like, they've made um, Prince of Darkness good, so... Or at least better. Like, Z3 did Unicorn straight, and it was weird and shit, and it didn't work. in a second.
Okay, so here's the thing. We don't need any help. I know what you're thinking. Getting help sounds pretty good shit, right? No. No. We don't need any help. Yep, this is what we have learned in the, the Z series, that when people get dumped into another world, they go, let's, like, stay out of it, this isn't our fight, we want this world to progress on its natural course without us fucking everything up. So, we're not gonna go distract Londo Bell from their job. We're not gonna go, Londo Bell, can you help us? And then Neo Zeon drops a colony on the Earth, and then it's our fault, so... Yeah, like, the crossover stuff in this is real good. And it just makes me, like... I don't think the mashup stuff has been like this in any other game that I can think of. Like, they've gone real good on it. Federation knew there are all these dudes around that we were helping and didn't tell them about. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> 